hi mba ct exam all the slots are over so this is just the expected cutoffs it's very difficult to predict the cutoff this year because jumbled paper different difficult level of every set paper very difficult to get reviews because uh, different people give different reviews because the exam is very different but based on whatever is known i just try to put a cutoff may not be accurate could be a little different but yes fair idea as to what could be expecting the slot 5 cutoff to be the highest in terms of because that was the easiest paper among all from whatever i got your information slot 5 paper was the highest slot 1 expected to be slightly low purely because of the surprise element i mean normally when you surprise the first slot people were 200 question they are surprised therefore it is expected to be low because of the surprise element which is there and slot 3 was low because the paper was lengthy and supposed to be a little tougher okay the toughest slot as far as whatever i got information is slot 3 slot 5 though there were a lot of max question but that could be one reason the cutoff could go higher because there could be a lot of people who are good at max could actually score you know very high in the max section and therefore push the cutoffs of slot so therefore i'm expecting slot 2 to be higher purely because there was a lot of max question which is not very difficult and there could be a few students who could score a high in max pushing up the cutoff to a higher extent. Uh, similarly, so slot 6 was comparatively easy. Uh, I mean, there were 4 5 DI questions, but more or less solvable pair pattern. Slot 4 stands somewhere in between of all these slots. So, this is how the whole expected cutoff is. So, Bajaj is expected to be 99.95 percentile around that, 99.94 percentile, and the corresponding marks for each slot is around this. Same as SIMC, 99.8 percentile is expected to be cut off and the corresponding marks required to get into is given out here. Wellington 99.4 percentile and maybe SIS 99 percentile. Also, the marks for different percentile is given out here. For some of the colleges, I have mentioned the cutoffs out here for the open OBC and SC category. That is the expected cutoff as such. For further analysis, we will wait and we will see what happens. Results are expected to be on 28, but this would give you a fair idea as to how or the cutoff should be. As I said, I am expecting it to be a slot wise, um, you know, percentiles and slot wise uh, analysis. So, based on slot wise, this is expected to be a cutoff, varying a lot purely because the difficult level of the paper has been varying a lot throughout the uh, different slots. I hope this helps. Yeah, keep your fingers crossed. Let's wait for the results and see. Thank you. All the best for the results.